yes, this student did have contact with our front office. And yes, his parents were on campus November 30th. Tim Throne, the superintendent of Oxford Community Schools, in a video message Thursday night talking about accused killer Ethan Crumbly. No discipline was warranted. There are no discipline records at the high school. Throne telling parents he would take questions at a later date, but this is all that can be released right now. We have parents that sent their kids to school two days ago and they're never coming home. Crumbly is facing murder and terrorism charges for killing four fellow students at Oxford High on Tuesday. Six other students and a teacher were also shot. To say that I am still uh, in shock and numb is uh, probably an understatement. Throne praising everyone involved in rescue efforts that fateful day. I could not be more proud of our staff teachers, our administration. We had administrators performing CPR. Our students did exactly as they had trained. While we had hoped that never in a million years would we ever have to pull this game plan out, we did, and I couldn't be more proud Throne saying he'd like video from the school released so parents can see and be proud too. Throne vowing to return to Oxford High, but says it will take time as they try to organize hundreds, if not thousands, of backpacks, coats, phones strewn throughout the school. This high school is a wreck right now. Maybe the best way to describe it is uh, it's like a war zone. I'm not sure how long, but it will be weeks probably before this building is ready. Throne says he spoke with Governor Gretchen Whitmer about getting the resources to get the school back in order. He's meeting with parents and following the funerals in the days ahead. They will begin the process of bringing students back. You're loved. We couldn't be more proud of you.